if any of you watched my video yesterday you'd have noticed that the quality was absolutely atrocious sound quality was bad video quality was terrible at some, at some point i mean I, I demonstrated something on the screen and the quality was just horrible i'm so sorry for that but ultimately i discovered that way too late i was halfway through the editing process and i realized there's something seriously going wrong there and it made me realize the importance of, of of getting stuff right now i've been doing youtube channels for quite a while but this is this is the first channel that i've done that where i actually appear in the camera and it makes a massive difference i mean it has so much editing the overhead more than doing channels without it in your face so what i decided to do is to make a video to show the difference in quality can make to not just a video but your sound i went down to kmart bought myself this bad boy 39 bucks absolutely worth it i'll you'll you'll hear the quality difference in the video okay so here i'm talking to the screen so i'm going to this screen now now i'm talking to the screen on obs and this is my face cam in my on my mac and you'll see, you can see the, the difference in quality is significant there's even a bunch of frame loss there where as opposed to at this one this is directly recording onto my samsung galaxy s9 and i'm going to import it in and edit the video in previously i actually used on my galaxy s9 i still use the front cam however i was syncing in using a um app i found online that actually shares the camera via wi-fi and then allows me to record directly on screen uses that uses my phone effectively as a webcam it's got limitations and i was ultimately not able to get it to work as efficiently as i thought works better than the built-in camera facetime camera from mac but it's it still had lag and it was challenged another problem i found was that i was using this device you see that it is it was causing a lot of issues because um the usb that's where the microphone plugged in as well as the audio was plugged in there and the usb c and it was heating up and i didn't realize where the problem was coming from but i was getting real disturbances in my audio and everything and i ultimately discovered it was this this was my problem so now i've swapped to one of these little usb c with normally old usb3 there and you just plug it in and the microphone works perfectly no problems audio i've plugged into the opposite side of the mac um that's my earphones in there my headset which is this bad boy here which is a Qantas earphone i got on a flight one day but it's surprisingly good quality reuse and there we go good All right so now uh let me do an audio test and i'll show you what comes out let's test this one out uh, i'm not sure how this is going to sound yet but let's go i need to start this one here right that's my start and okay so I'm going to talk about this. I'm looking at the camera because I keep looking at the screen and it looks like I'm staring past you, but actually I'm supposed to be staring at the iPhone or the camera. So I've got it there. It's simple enough. And I've got the mic running on the other side. So we're going to try and sync up the audio and the video. I'm going to see what the quality of this video is. All right, let's try. All right, now that we have seen what the difference in quality of video can do for you and what the quality of just a simple simple tweak using your phone direct instead of trying to plug it into your pc trying to plug it in via wi-fi or whatever all the gimmicks i tried it's as simple as just record straight off your phone your phone which in my case this s9 is a couple of years old but still it's i'm recording it higher than 1080 so all I, i'm the quality is higher than i actually need and it comes out perfect and uh, the audio is directly recording into quick time here into my mac not through obs so much less risk of having glitches on my audio it's just simple little tweaks 
and you'll have absolutely a fantastic outcome. So um, yeah, just quick mention on those. I mean, if you, you could hear on those different audios that I played there, I was actively switching the mics on and off um, in, switch between the different um, audio channel, channels and you could significantly hear the difference in all the the microphone capabilities if you want to call it that. So yeah, there is uh, no alternative for a good mic. I've so many people have told me that and I thought I could do better but I thought I was stubborn. I thought ah cheap mic I'll make it work. Desktop mic I'll make it work. Laptop mic, uh, a built in mic, I'll make it work. FaceTime camera, I'll make it work. Nah. Just doesn't quite have that edge to it. Proper HD, it does the right thing. Go on, enjoy it. Hit like, hit subscribe. If you liked this video, if it was useful for you, thank you very much. There's a link for buy me a coffee in the description. Consider buying me a coffee. I'd appreciate it. Thanks. I need it. It's late nights.